Yeah. 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 The left nostril. The left pass. nostril. No, because uh, because we take off the teeth, right? Yeah. Uh, because no. the fistula will go the roots. It's yeah. possible. Up into the, the nose. <laughs> the roots have gone into the nasal passage. Yeah. 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 So it gets infected easily, la. But it should clear yeah. antibiotics, ah. Yes. No, no she was saying that it didn't respond to antibiotics. Because the the, the sauce is still there. Yeah, the sauce is still there. We didn't remove the tooth. So what do you say? It was dripping what, six months, right? Dripping. Yeah. On Actually, the floor. I never asked you to do that, man. Well. Uh, no, I because it. I uh I we did suspect it was probably like uh, upper respiratory tract infection, uh. Yeah. It normally is upper respiratory tract infection, uh, or tumor yeah. in the nose. Yeah. Tumor. No, okay, yeah. No, she said it was so dramatic. Yeah, dramatic. I can't believe it. Yeah. Because I didn't take a photo when it was having the discharge, yeah. but I saw it. Hmm? One more antibiotics will clear everything fully. Once yeah. the, the, the passage closes, uh, it will clear everything. Yeah, so like I said, I have to find a trick to give him his antibiotics without pumping his heart. Wait, open his, open his uh, gum and let me see the teeth. Which one? The, here, uh, huh? uh, uh, the left upper one. Yeah. Is it the, recovering? The, the hole, huh? Yeah, the hole is closed already, almost. Up a bit more. No, it doesn't bite you, right? Last time it doesn't allow people to open. Baby, it's okay. There? It's okay, baby. There, you see the hole? Okay, yeah, there you go. Closing it's up okay, already. Very good and colour is very good. Yeah, the colour is very good. So, what was your complaint that it wasn't it walking? Or? He was lethargic, he was sleeping all the time. I guess because he didn't eat for three days, uh, anybody will be lethargic. Like, yeah. We're just sleeping, I don't talk to you, I don't look at you, that kind of thing. Was he lethargic after the anesthesia? Yeah. Huh? After yeah. anesthesia? He, he, he went home, remember? He went home, then he was uh, kind of like, let him rest, so... Yeah. No, he wasn't lethargic at the time? Yeah, he was a bit resting. So the anesthesia might affect him because he's yeah. an old fellow? Yeah. Although so he just first day, guessed, we don't suspect anything. So the like second day, third day, I keep vomiting, uh, cannot. Uh. First day is most important, so he was eating or not? First day, uh, no. Uh, no one. <laughs> I think I think the, the anesthetic really takes enough. time to get out of his system, the anesthetic gas. Because the it takes about half an hour, you know, even though yeah. you, you see such a minor thing, because you have to scale the teeth. You know. Yeah. But he was standing and walking, you know. Yeah. Like this, ah. Uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like getting this. up, he needs a bit of help, lah. So I guess it's just. Uh, you know, but was he still coughing? No. Huh? Less. No, I mean at, at uh, second day after. No. Huh? Less. Less, ah. Uh. That's due to the drugs, ah. Uh. Well, I gave him the drug to clear his lungs. Today I give him another one, ah. Uh. So tomorrow you continue to uh, okay. clear the lungs or not, the first Yeah. Uh, Want to yeah. go home already? Yeah, I go home. So, okay. Ah, okay. So this is a success story of a 16-year-old Shetland male who had a persistent left nostril nasal discharge and uh, he's just dirtying the floor the apartment floor for six months. For that six months, I think the owner did see the vet, one, one of us, and uh, despite antibiotics, he's still having this discharge. So, two days ago, the owner finally consented to have this dog anesthetized, which is a very high risk for a 16 year old dog. So the dental, the, the left upper canine tooth was really loose and you can see the root itself, <coughs> you see the other video, the root itself was really uh, shrunken at the, at the apex of the root here. So the bacteria from the root, the, the shrunken root, decay root, went up to the nasal passages which as you can see is quite near to the the root is quite near to the the root is quite near to the nostril the root is here the root is here you can see there you can see it doesn't like me to touch his nose anyway you see the other video and uh, so according to the owner now there's a dramatic decrease in nasal discharge, in fact, there's no more dripping on the floor. So that's good. That's good news for this 16-year-old Shetland. So the diagnosis was surprisingly not mala abscess.
not carnassial tooth excess but a canine tooth abscess because this dog lives so old that uh, such abscesses such root abscesses do occur but very rarely in in the canine you see the color is very good pink it's a uh, nutrition is good it's coat is good and uh, you can see the color of the tongue really good color you can see very good color not pale or you see the color of the tongue it's still signs of good health sufficient Libra cells, hemoglobin, good food. He just said the last two days after anesthesia, he was vomiting. Vomiting twice. For some reason, but one of the reasons would be the endotracheal tube into his throat for anesthesia and then the scaling and extraction might have irritated his uh, throat, the pharynx. So, so when he eats, of course, he will throw out because something irritating in your throat, you will throw out as well. Yeah. And for the last two days, he had been doing it, but not, not more than twice per, per day. So that's why the, the dog is here now. Two days after the dental extraction of the left upper canine. And there's been a drip in painkillers and uh, all medication should be stopped for the time being except for the heart medication because it does need the, the drug to clear the water from the lungs and uh, so that he can live a happier life April 18 to 16 now he's going home the oldest dog in Singapore oldest Shetland yeah. the oldest Shetland in Singapore he can still walk only he got a bit of arthritis right but they can get up last two days from yeah yeah he can get up it's just like i see already i have long enough already yeah i think he knows still by so help him up was it six months or more than six months that the nose discharged one year no less how do how do you know just see it dripping all that one yeah more than six months yeah more than six months but you only been given antibodies once only right yeah no i mean before that yeah can go home already Okay, let's Good, go. Thank